is Somerville for us, you know? We're part of the community, we want to engage with people, and this is our way of doing that. So that's what Dancing on the Row is, in essence. It's a wonderful event that brings people together to have a good time and just have an awesome experience on the row. I am Lady from Meta Movements, and I've been called upon by Assembly Row at Assembly Square to put on the salsa party. And we're calling it Dancing on the Row, the Somerville Salsa Series. People love this event just because simply you just come and you dance and you have a good time. If you don't even know how to dance salsa or merengue or bachata or any of those other Latin forms of dance, you come and you can watch people. You see families come with their kids and they say, listen to that song, you know? Like that's bachata, or that's merengue, that's salsa. And it's such a great learning experience for everyone who may not know what these types of dances are to kind of experience the whole diversity that is Somerville because there's so many Latino people in Somerville and it's our way to kind of just have people experience that. Pretty much all of our events, um, you'll find all kinds of people. You'll find people of all ages. So a lot of people here, some of them we've never met and hopefully they will follow us where we go. Um, and the goal is to have people meet each other, dance with different people, because it's not about just dancing with the person you came with, but really to dance with different people and meet different people. Yeah, we walked up and down and we're impressed by the whole, the whole scene, but this, this attracts a good crowd. And I think the nice thing is, is that, because we're a couple and have been for many years, but people would changing partners, which is really neat. My favorite thing is just kind of seeing people go, go from zero to knowing how to dance. So many people here this evening, but like, um, as an example, I've never danced salsa before, and now they're social dancing. Like, you know, you, normally you would go somewhere and if they're playing salsa and you don't know how to dance, you're kind of just sitting around looking. And so it, for me, seeing people's faces light up when they figure something out, like, wow, I can do a right turn. Um, and then getting people excited to want to learn more and want to go out more and dance more and meet new people, um, that's my favorite part. People who are, who are signing up for the competition just learned salsa tonight and they're not afraid to do a competition so that's pretty cool it was a great experience awesome. i kind of learned how to do the turn so um it was great it was it was great to see how diverse it was the group and how everybody was interested um it's nice to see even my partner you know who i didn't know was so relaxed and wanted to learn so it was a great experience i mean look at this place it's so energetic and just to have this an assembly row, it just, it fits perfectly. So my name is Alex, this is Katie. Uh, we're ballroom dancers that love to do salsa dancing as well. Uh, Katie's been dancing for going on eight years, eight years now, and I've been dancing for about five. Having people watch us is nothing new because in ballroom, everyone's watching you all the time and critiquing you. Um, it's nice to be a little bit more relaxed and yeah. people can just enjoy our dancing, we can enjoy our dancing. Oh my god, it's nice. much more relaxed. Yes. I love the social atmosphere. Um, I love the fact that you can meet new people all the time. You meet all new levels of dancers. I personally actually really like dancing with new dancers uh, because that means they're trying something new and that means that I get to be a part of that. I think it's just awesome to have the atmosphere and I think it's really nice to bring in a lot of people off the street too because you'll see people walk by and they're really fascinated and they want to check it out. So I think that's a really great aspects. There are restaurants, there are shopping opportunities, and it's not just you go into the club or something. Like, you get to go out and interact with other people, you know, yeah. go shopping, get food. Absolutely, awesome. and it's right next to a tea stop. And I mean, right now we're going to go and grab dinner. We're not sure where though, but there are so many great options that we can't go wrong. It was great for Assembly Row to put this on. It gets the crowd together and it's a good community experience. Yeah, and Meta Movements that puts it on, and they've been doing They're it for awesome. years. They're really great. They're all about communities. This is the first outdoor dancing I've seen here, so it's awesome. I think it got so many people together. Um, I go shopping a lot here. I'm a shopaholic, so I've been here quite a few times. But uh, no, tonight was the best night Yeah, yeah, this mall is amazing too. I like how they integrated the community and it really like renovated or, or revitalized this whole area. Cause this used to be more of an industrial area and yeah. it made it into something happening. 
The parking's free or one dollar, you know. The, a lot of great shopping around here. We went to films here. The film, the theater is awesome. Oh, yeah, yeah. And yeah, so this is this is a great location. It really changed everything in Somerville. Dancing on the Row is going to happen throughout the summer. Um, check our website for all the events. Uh, definitely for September 7th, that's our kickoff to Riverfest, which is our biggest event of the year. It's our gift to the city of Somerville. It's a big day of music, artisans, fireworks. So that'll be the day before. Um, but regardless, Assembly Row is happy to be part of Somerville and we want to have more and more people come to this event to make it even more special throughout the years.